So good day, welcome back. Uh, today we got four mail calls. It's quite a few. Um, sorry if I've put out too many videos in the last 24 hours, but I'm just trying to keep on top. And I've got four mail calls. Got to get them out there. <laughs> four top quality channels. Uh, we'll go in the order that I got them. Uh, start off with this bad boy. It's a big one. I won't show you the address. That's the uh, that's how it works. But this one's come from Quebec, Quebec, Canada. Over there somewhere. Not over there somewhere. Over there. So it's a big one. Um, I've already opened all these. You might have seen them on Instagram if you follow me on Instagram. If you don't, link down below. So what do we got? So look, it's from the Plough Guys. John and Justin, great guys, cool channel. I am um, shift snow and do fun projects and that kind of stuff. So, they're awesome stickers, only on YouTube. I also sent a mouse mat. That's pretty cool. Move or get ploughed from the plough guys, only on YouTube. Great channel, check them out. Thanks John and Justin, awesome. I've already used that, well, I've been using that for a couple of weeks to uh, write essays and that kind of stuff. So that's all done, so yeah, cool. Thanks for that. Uh, next one. It's a wee fella. This one's from Hartford, Connecticut, is it? Uh, I'll show you the envelope. But he's managed to put the stamps on the right way up, which is upside down if you're sending it down under. So that's pretty cool. Let's see what this one's all about. Look at that, Captain Jerk. Captain Jerk on YouTube. Uh, Justin, another Justin. Hey Badger, here's your sticker. Remember to watch out for snakes. Now when I first read that, it didn't make a lot of sense to me because we don't have any snakes in New Zealand. But then I remembered it's a reference to the Badger, Badger, Badger song. Snake. So, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Uh, Captain Jerk, he, he does some cool stuff. He makes coin rings and stuff. In fact, I think I've got There we go. Got some coins up here actually. Um, so this was my first attempt at making a coin ring. But uh, doing it with a three pound lump hammer, the whole thing just got a wee bit cattywampus. So I gave up on that one. I didn't have any patience, so good on you. He's just finished off a um, cool, looking, cool looking copper arrowhead that's taken him Seems like forever. It's been cool to watch, but it's taken forever. It's been a lot of work to get to make that. Uh, so yeah, good on you. He's, he's pretty, pretty talented guy. He likes making stuff like that. I meant to send him some coins. Actually, this is pointless, useless Australian coin. Don't know what he could do with that, but might get some coins in the mail to you at some point. See what you can do with them. But yeah, Captain Jerk, Justin, top guy, funny guy. Makes some cool vids, makes lots of vids, heaps of vids. But yeah, I've got a finally had a chance to catch up on his channel and I'm a big fan. So check him out, Captain Jerk. If you're searching on YouTube for him, don't put a space between Captain and Jerk, otherwise he'll never show up in the, um, the search. Captain Jerk, all one word, will be the top result. So check him out. <coughs> Next one, another one from Canada. Got a deer or a moose on the stump. Either way, cool stamps. Oh, look at that. Bullshit Corner, Jerry at Bullshit Corner. Another top quality channel. He does some awesome stuff. Fixing up a old car of some sort. Does lots of welding, gold mining, outdoors stuff. Cool guy. Likes his beer. Uh, likes to destroy jump starters. He's done some awesome videos on destroying those shitty... Pardon my French. Try not to swear on my channel, but we don't have swear words in New Zealand. Words are just words. Anyone can say anything and it's not a swear word, so I've just got to have to remember <laughs> that YouTube's a wee bit different. So, Jerry, top guy, check him out. He's got two channels, Bullshit Corner and BS Corner. Uh, one's slightly more family friendly, but they're both awesome channels. Check him out. Um, 
I really want to crack open that beer, but anyway, we'll get on with the last one and hopefully I can open the beer. Uh, last one. Thomas CXO VCDS. Thomas is a top chap. Oh, chuck that around. So you also notice he's got four stamps the right way up and one the wrong way. Well, the other right way up. So you have four stamps to get it from Canada to New Zealand and one stamp which is a down under stamp to get it from the border to me. So that's he, he's on to it this Thomas. He knows exactly what's going on. This one's kind of heavy. There's something in here. So we'll see what that is. From Canada somewhere. Where is he? British Columbia. We've got some more Thomas stickers, I've got a few of these all around the place, There's some on my trailer, some on my toolbox, some on my power probe, some everywhere. They get around these things just like Thomas, he gets around, top guy. He's also sent me a, a bottle opener. I'm lucky we've got this beer sat here so we can actually open it. If I can get into it, we need a... So that's pretty cool. Canada on both sides. Real metal, one of the maple leaf, oh, that's weird, maple leaf doohickey on the back. Let's see if it can open this Australian beer. Works well. Might have to be in my tool of the week video. Just to make you jealous. Like there's a beer, even if it is Australian, but Australians can make decent beer. Coopers and little little creatures and a few of us are James Bogues. Can make good beer. Yeah, Thomas is a top guy. Big fan of his. He's also a big supporter of my channel. He's a big fan of my, my little boy Charlie too. He seems to creep up on Thomas's videos as well, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, he's got some fans all around the world already, as little Charlie. But um, they say Can Canadians are the friendliest people you'll ever meet. And Germans are the most efficient people you meet, ever meet. So uh, Thomas is a German-Canadian or Canadian-German. So he's the most efficiently friendly person you'll ever meet. He's fantastic. Can't do enough for you, Thomas. Top guy. Uh, but that comes to everything. We've still got the um, 300 subscriber competition going. Sorry it's a wee bit hard. <laughs> that video I had wasn't really meant for a competition but someone told me it might be a good idea and yeah it's, it's gonna work out well. There's some good entries in there so you haven't entered already put your best answer down be below the video. I'll put a link to it down below and we'll see how we go. A couple of weeks left to go on that one. Um, I just wanted to say thank you to all, all my subscribers really. I've had a, quite a few in the last couple of weeks. So I think I've, we're still running the 300 subscriber competition on kind of over 350 subscribers now. So that's pretty awesome. So thanks for all the support. I know there's a lot of people who've subscribed to me recently that I haven't had a chance to look at your channel or subscribe back to you or that kind of stuff. And, but I'll get there. Just give me a couple of weeks. I'll have some more free time. I'll get in and have a look at your channels. Uh, I kind of, I don't like just subscribing to people. I, when I do it, I actually want to kind of take the time to look at your videos, see what kind of stuff you do, because a lot of the channels we get into are a bit more specialist. You, know, you actually have to concentrate and watch a few videos to actually understand what they're all about and get the benefits from them. So I'll get there. So bear with me. Um, Thanks for the subs, really appreciate it. And yeah, I uh, should have some good videos coming up soon anyway, so just got a couple of weeks more of, of stuff going on in my life outside of YouTube that I just need to get sorted and then we'll be rocking into some pretty awesome videos. So uh, thanks for the support. Keep making awesome videos. I'll watch as much as I can. So yeah, thanks for all the awesome mail calls, top channels, I'll link them all below. And uh, thanks for watching. See you at the next one.